Hey guys, welcome back to another Mkaba Monday. Today, um, we're gonna do some really fun ab workouts. I'm gonna do reverse crunches, and I also wanted to discuss something about abs today. So, with regards to abs, guys, you want to work out the center abs more if you want a small waist, but if you want a really strong trunk, then you want to include oblique workouts. So, I don't really do oblique workouts because the way my body's set up, I'm gonna be like straight, like you know, and my obliques are gonna pop out a lot, like a lot. So it's not gonna be, you know, cute and whatever. So that's why I focus more on the center. So it all depends on what you want. Do you want core strength, you know, to be able to do crazy things with your body, or do you want a small waist? If you want a small waist, then focus on the center, like your abdominal muscles. But if you want a strong core and a strong trunk, then you wanna add oblique workouts as well. So just, um, as I mentioned again, focus on nutrition. I showed you guys was it last week or the week before where if you don't focus on nutrition you really won't have a flat stomach like you'll have a strong core because your core will get strong regardless of your nutrition because you're tearing down the muscle and if you are feeding the muscle correctly with protein and you're resting but you're adding more fat than you're burning you're not gonna see the abs but the abs are gonna be there underneath so you need to address the layer of fat guys and cardio and nutrition is the easiest way to address fat like if fat is what you don't want cardio and nutrition straight up so yeah let me get into that it's not so hot today it's actually quite windy so yeah I'm gonna get into that today and yeah happy Monday. first up we're have toe touches or toe reaches so what you're going to do is basically um, lift, lift your legs up as straight as you possibly can I really struggle to keep my legs up straight because they're heavy <laughs> and you're gonna try and touch your toes basically in a crunch fashion and you're gonna want to use your abs to lift you up and you want to tuck in your neck because you will injure your neck if you don't tuck it in you do see me adjust my neck a couple times you need to tuck your neck in when you're reaching for your toes we're gonna do 15 for three sets next up we have the reverse crunches i mentioned in the intro so what you want to do is be as controlled and deliberate as possible when lifting your legs so you're going to lift your legs and your pelvis using your abdominal muscles instead of using your glutes or your lower back you really will feel this in your like core right in the middle of your abs it does not play it looks like i'm not doing much but wow 15 three sets next up we have another form of crunches so these are v split crunches so what you're going to do is when you crunch forward you're going to split your legs open in a v shape as you can see i really do struggle keeping my legs up straight because they really are heavy like so heavy they feel like a thousand million kgs guys my legs are heavy anyway you want to tuck in your neck once again you do see me adjust myself here again and you're going to do 15 of these as well for three sets. So next up we have hip dips with a mountain climber variation so you're basically going to get into a full plank position go from side to side using your hips and then get into um, your mountain climber position and then that's one rep basically so you're going to do 10 of these and as you can see like you need to be deliberate and my waist is not like as strong to carry my hips so i have to be deliberate like i'm packing a lot so it's not as easy <laughs> yeah 10 for three sets you want to be deliberate guys and you don't want to injure yourself as well
and last up we have a reverse bridge march so what you're going to do is get into a bridge position and basically lift each leg one by one and you want to engage your core instead of your glutes with this and your upper body so you want to feel it more in your triceps and your core that's why i'm a bit dipped instead of being fully straight in a bridge position and you need to fight for it hey so you're going to do 15 on each leg um for three sets you you do feel this you really do enjoy guys see you next wednesday